Well, do we have a surprise for you today? We are here at one of the most iconically named businesses ever. We are here at Dead People's Stuff, which is part antique store, part architectural salvage, um, part gift shop, but it is definitely and probably most of all, a trip back in time. Oh, yeah. It is absolutely incredible. Understatement. <laughs> Understatement. It is here in Oklahoma City in an area that they are dubbing now the Ironworks District. There's a fabulous barbecue shop nearby. There is a, a of all things, a cat cafe. Um, it is just so fun, so both whimsical and interesting and a great place to shop. And I have a connection to the people that live inside on many, many different levels. So what do you say, Stuart? Let's do it. Let's do it. It's good to see yeah. you. Uh, well, be before we begin, some business here. Uh, my husband, Jamie, big Jamie, says to say hello to your dad. That's and right. little Jamie says to say hello to you. Yes, I am. Jealous of him in Denver. Yeah, yeah. So they, um, they're about my younger son, Jamie's age. And they all knew each other and kind of... Um, Kind of, I don't know if you palled around together or yeah, just a little knew bit. We'd always each kind other. Of see each other at parties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You went to different high schools and things. Well, this is, I'm embarrassed to say, I haven't been in in a long time. When it was and architectural been, antiques, maybe. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But didn't you say Bricktown? I know, in Bricktown. So I'm, I know I'm kind of embarrassed to say that. But this place is absolutely magical. It's a trip back in time. And if you are, well, I'm just going to stop here. Tell me a little bit about yourself, about this journey that you've been on with this place and your connected businesses. Just, sure. And by the way, another connection is they live around the corner from We're me. Neighbors. We're neighbors. Yeah. We're neighbors. Right. Yeah. Okay, so tell us about it. So we met in Southern well, California. This is, introduce oh. your. Oh, this is Mary Marr, my Mary wife. Marr. Sorry, yeah. yeah. And this is Flea Fox Capus Fudge. He's a fox <laughs> cow pussycat. Uh, we found him on his little rescue. Born. Uh, but he yeah. was a rescue, yeah, a yeah, little he's rescue. A little rescue. So we classroom. met, we met in the University of Redlands in Southern California, and then we backpacked India for a year after undergrad. So we had this silly idea of <laughs> let's bring Eastern tribal doors to Middle America. And so when she moved back here, we started working in real estate, flipping homes and buying in the foreclosure, Mostly historical, doing historical. Yeah. Our family yeah. does this historic preservation, and so. We've been coming to the store since I was a child and kind of running around and my dad used to be a, a big customer for his projects and uh, they were looking to sell a building and we said, what, what about the building? We we're looking to buy it and... and uh, the rest is history, huh? Yeah, absolutely. So yeah, five, oh. five years literally. later. Yeah. Literally, the rest <laughs> yeah. is history. So yeah, this well, is... Well, Jack was like, we were, yeah, he's like, the kids can run it. The so, antique shop. Uh, so we didn't know like, anything about antiques. So, yeah. So we spent, yeah. So we have learned a lot. <laughs> we have learned a lot. Yeah. But you've had a lot of instruction because you brought, this is this is what I love, you brought your whole family with you from San Diego yes. so, to come yeah. here. Yeah, my so they, whole family, mom, sisters, they're all in the background. They all, we all work <laughs> together. Hey guys, hey sorry. guys. <laughs> so we all work together in real estate and dead people stuff, doing our Airbnbs and, and just kind of, it's a fun family business, uh, the dead people stuff. So it's, it's definitely a treasure. Yeah, and but but as we were talking earlier, you're a whole cottage industry yourself. It reminds me a little bit of of uh, like Reed Drummond and oh, Magnolia yeah. Cafe. Oh, yeah. yeah, because they be, they are doing a lot here in this whole. Somebody's trying to reach you. Somebody, yeah. you must be important. Contractors. Yeah. You must be important. <laughs> okay. Um, but tell us a little bit about what is here and what other enterprises you have going, one of which I'm going to be checking out this fall for a family reunion. So. Oh, yes. That's El Sueño, our 1930s Spanish mansion. It's a. Uh, it's here in downtown, it's roughly just unbelievable. Seven unbelievable. Acres. Yeah. Seven acres. It's on seven acres, and it's a fun little project. So uh, I think it sleeps like 24, 28 folks, but it's it's just a beautiful 1930s home. That was for our last project. 
currently we're working on the old well, I'm gonna interrupt you for just a minute Stuart right here let's put some images of Elsuenia right here to give sure. you an idea of what you're talking about because sure. it's kind of reeks of old Hollywood old yeah it doesn't feel like Oklahoma it, it, no, it's 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 incredible. So I apologize. Go no, ahead. you're good. So then we have Gabriella's not too far down the road from that. It's this old 1930s. It used to be called the Kentucky Club. Back which... in back in my day and <laughs> my partying days. Yes. So you, yeah, yours was the second iteration. So it was 1930s back in Prohibition and then revamped in the 80s. So we'll be the third iteration uh, doing that. And we've got some fun fun pieces from around the shop that we're featuring and highlighting there. And that's all, by the way, near the uh, Oklahoma Cowboy Hall of Fame, or yes, what's it called now? Yeah. The, the National, National Heritage National Museum. National Western yeah. Museum, okay. Yes, okay. absolutely. Uh, and then so we, we've got some apartments, we're on some high-end rentals, and just, we have a bunch of Airbnbs, so when you're here visiting Linda, you can check out Dead People's yeah. Stuff's Airbnbs. But here at De this, comp what we call the compound, we spent the last five years putting together, so we've this was the old 1940s Caterpillar, and so super cool. The cat bulldozers, you know, you've yeah, got, this was so the cool. showroom we're standing in where the bulldozers, you've got this big garage door back there that was the manufacturing warehouse. And so we brought a barbecue, a tattoo shop, a barber shop, cat cafe, kind of with dead people stuff as the anchor tenant to yeah. try to make a one-stop shop, fun, just family, friend, friendly orientated. Yeah. Well, just, we, we met some people on the way in and they're here from Chicago. Oh, oh heck yeah, awesome. love yeah. that. Yeah. yeah, I mean, we get people from New York, we get people from- oh, From LA, everywhere. everywhere. Well, they, because if you're looking for really interesting things, um, and we won't keep you too much longer before we look around, but you don't, you have a lot more than doors here. Architectural salvage <laughs> doors, you have, hardware you have light fixtures you have mantles mantles yeah, items. You, have movie, have, yeah. you have movie set items yep, yep, the, from pillars of the flower yeah, moon yeah pillars of the flower moon cool. um years and years ago i bought the fireplace surround that i had at my other house oh we, beautiful we, we bought here um so it's just it's just amazing but you also have smaller gift shop items you have sure. yes yeah, sm you know tokens that's right say. yeah so we we yeah, like to say like you say we're architectural salvage so we we focus on building materials, doors, light fixtures, mantles, mm -hmm. stained glass, all that jazz like you talked about. But then we also have home decor for people. Not everyone needs a door, you know? So right. uh, we, we've just got little fun trinkets, random funky junk, little oddities. But in, in all price ranges. Right, I absolutely. Yeah. In yeah. all yeah. price ranges. But if you're looking for that one very specific piece, to fix an old chandelier, to match something that you have in your, like me, in your 1930s home or whatever, yeah. this is this is kind of your resource in Oklahoma. Historic you, preservation is super, we're, our yeah. family's super passionate about historic preservation. Yeah. So Film Row is kind of our district and then we're trying to, trying to revamp here and rebrand this to Ironworks District. Yeah. Uh, and so, yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of fun. We appreciate you guys coming through. Well, no, it is, it is beyond fun. Plan on coming out here and spending a long Mi Yeah, minimum hour walkthrough is what I told you. And, and so we'll just end on this note. If you come in and you are not at all familiar with this place, mm. um, what would you say to somebody who might be overwhelmed if they're not necessarily, or what would you say to them? I think most people are pretty overwhelmed when they come here because there is so much just chaos of whatness. But it is, we have it organized. Can, yeah, you can come in and we can help you, the, our employees, and we can help you. But everything's organized, so everything has like its section. So there's light fixture section, the door section. Stained glass, gardening, wrought iron, glass. iron pretty, for gates. Yeah, it's kind of all put together. Um, it's still, there's things You could spend around. days just looking at door knockers. <laughs> yeah. But yes. outside in the back where like the loading docks are, there are there's a bunch of fun stuff for your garden, either yard art or oh, some yeah, rod iron. Been, I haven't been out there pots yet. And planters, oh, yeah. my, is it just straight That's that just straight away? back, yeah, that'd be your <laughs> section outside. for sure. Okay, it might be a multi-day <laughs> yeah. uh, excursion. But anyhow, thank you guys. Thank you, thank you for doing this for Oklahoma City, course, yeah. which is, we were saying earlier, Oklahoma City is the new Austin. Hey, it, we it, love that. I it agree. is just, it has become so cool. There's so much to do, which is gonna be my excuse for why I didn't get back here earlier. Hey. Okay. Tell your dad that but that we said hello. Will do. Yes, okay. And it was so nice to <laughs> so meet nice you to finally. Meet you. Yes. Neighbors. Yes. Neighbors. Neighbors. <laughs> yeah, we're already planning a little soiree right. on the yeah. social media. That's right. Absolutely. Social Some media. wine. Okay. Well, we're going to start looking around. Yeah, enjoy. So, appreciate thanks. you guys. Uh -huh. Oh, and by the way, you guys will appreciate this. I know I did. Curran 
is he is named after Gene Curran Kelly, <laughs> a la Singing in the Rain. That's right. Singing so in the rain. all of us that that love that reference, um, I love that too, and it it guaranteed you a happy disposition. Hey, that's right. Absolutely, <laughs> Singing in the Rain. No yeah, doubt. Yeah. Good. Good. Good job, that's Chip. Good <laughs> okay. Thank you, we'll see you guys. Cheers. Well, it's taken us forever to get to the point where we're actually showing you some stuff because <laughs> we have been talking and talking. We've got so many connections. Number one, when you come in, you're probably going to want to sign up with your email to get 10% off or just find out what kind of whimsical, wonderful, um, wacky things they have here. They're kind of, I think, first and foremost known for their doors. And Stuart, I'm going to rely on you for a tag <laughs> check, but also <laughs> to keep us to keep us moving. Um, earlier when I lived at the old house, this is where I got the surround for my fireplace here. So oh. they have those kinds of things here, yeah. uh, wood and marble stone. They have fabulous doors. So I know um, a lot of people in Oklahoma City come here to access doors mm -hmm. and windows if they are building custom gates, if they're building custom greenhouses, conservatories, things like that and so the doors are incredible a lot of them they have retrofitted with antique glass art from germany from all around europe they source all over the world so lose any preconceptions of the provenance of whatever it is you see yeah. when you come in it's not it is from everywhere yeah, it, yeah it is from absolutely everywhere okay when i came in I immediately spotted this bird bath, Aww. and I am coveting it. Um, so tell me what you guys think. I mean, I love my bird bath that I have, but maybe gorgeous. I need another one. This one is absolutely gorgeous. It's got a fabulous patina. Um, I'm not sure of, of where it, oh, it's, it's Italian. Um, it came from Italy, and it's actually at a pretty good price. It's five fifteen, but but if you had ten percent off or or whatever, and I don't know if they ever have any kind of sales or anything, mm -hmm. but this is incredibly beautiful. Um, this is really really wonderful, and at other antique stores in Oklahoma City would be at a much higher price point. So doors, I guess, first and foremost. This it's, is gorgeous. Right? Isn't, yeah. Mm -hmm. And Leah, when you walk around, and by the way, if you guys didn't know it, Leah does acting and she's, she, <laughs> yeah, yes. dropping this in yeah, yeah, I'm kind of dropping that in. <laughs> Leah, yes, Leah is doing, she's multi yes, she, she's multi-talented. Multi she does acting <laughs> commercials, she's, humans, and movies. And now she's blushing. And now she's <laughs> blushing. I wasn't I'm, I'm expecting gonna, that. I'm, I'm Shout gonna, out. I'm, I'm going to get in trouble later, let's just say. Okay, but enjoy, enjoy pieces as you walk through because a lot of them, as in one of the other places we visited, another antique store we visited, a lot of these things have been used on movie sets. Oh, yeah. And particularly and good most segue. recently, oh, Killers, a good segue. Killers, wow. <laughs> Killers of the Flower Moon. Great movie. Um, so a number of pieces here were, were used in that. Um, the thing I am looking for here, uh, in case you're interested, I'm looking at at rugs. I'm always I'm looking at rugs. With all the rugs. I am too. I'm always looking for obviously for blue and white. I I kind of am, am looking at door knockers because I think I want a knocker for my back gate. That um, would be cute. Yeah. I'm looking for a Father's Day gift. Okay, what kind? Maybe a door knocker. My dad does building. He rebuilds and restores things, so something fun that he could incorporate into the house. And, and he raises peacocks. Yeah, my mom raised they, yeah, they, they raise peacocks. So, yeah. um, and, if there and, was a peacock door knocker, that would be legit. That would and be. And it's just so fun to look through the treasures. Yeah, they're so kind of random. yeah. Like, I mean, and some of them, if you if you want a Western vibe, if you want an East Asian Indian vibe, if Jesus, you angel baby. Yeah, if if you want a Victorian vibe. Um, so many. Oh, I like this one. Oh, my mom would like um, that. All right, show, show the camera. Yeah, I mean, they, and something like this, these one-of-a-kind things, I think would just absolutely be wonderful. These make great gifts, I think. My mom's going to watch this and be like, go back and go get, get that it. Go back Thanks. and get, yeah, <laughs> absolutely. And, you know, some people really love certain kinds of animals. So, mm -hmm. but all of this stuff, they shop estate sales everywhere. Um, 
in and outside of Oklahoma. Stuart? They said a lot of people call them too because they know about dead people's stuff and when there's pieces that are very historic, they want it to go somewhere that they'll know what to do with it. And so they said a lot of the windows, people call them when they're taking down old churches and things. Um, so that they go to the right place. Yeah, and there's so many stained glass pieces here. And we'll respect history. Yes, yeah. Um, another tip, look up. Mm -hmm. Oh, this isn't even the room. To and really this isn't even that. really the room. But, to, but, but not, just, <laughs> not just look up for things suspended from the ceiling, but just for things that are up high because you never know. Lots of custom, Leah, have you looked at, have you looked at some of these leather bags? Yes, uh, my mom bought one last time we were here. Oh, she did? Also I mean, yeah. really wonderful. So cute. Look at this. Oh, it how cute like you. is that? It looks like both of us. Here, you've got a, a summer bag. Okay. That would be oh, cool. that is wonderful. For when you walk to Midtown. Yes. That is wonderful, it's and big so enough cute. for a big enough for a uh, magazine or something. Mm -hmm. I don't see a tag on it. We may have to ask about that. Okay. Um, cute. But again, if you're visiting Oklahoma City, really they have good little gifts here. Yeah. yeah, they do have good little gifts. Um, let's show. For you. Let's show this rack of of rugs, and these Gorgeous. are at good price points. Yeah, they actually. They are, are really at good price points. So I've something. Been, um, one thing to protect my furniture is a lot of times I'll put one of these over my ottoman, that yeah, white I don't know ottoman, how you do that. Yeah. because otherwise um, hubs and just the people in and out of my life. <laughs> I've been looking at rugs at thrift stores or Facebook Marketplace, but it kind of is a little sketchy to me to right. have to clean them so well. So I'm like, yeah. these are really a nice price for what? Yeah, they and are. for the care. And they're of, new and gorgeous. Yes. Or, and um, yeah, and it's an inexpensive way, I think, or relatively inexpensive way to change out stuff seasonally. Let's take a little break here while we go and locate a different area of this fabulous warehouse that we'll show you. Okay, so this is an example of that, this Victorian piece. Tell us about it, Leah. Well, if you haven't seen Killers of the Flower Moon, it's an amazing movie with Leonardo DiCaprio and Lily Gladstone. It won a lot of awards. It's really good. Really long movie, but yeah. well, well <laughs> worth it. Well worth it. And, and that may be why I haven't watched it, but I'm coveting these blue Ooh, and white, yes. this blue and white china. I wonder if these pieces here. were inside of it in the movie. We'll have to I bet they were. Yeah. yeah. The other thing is, interestingly, there are so many places in and around Oklahoma. If you don't know this about Oklahoma City, lots of filming and movie work is done mm -hmm. here. And because of that, a lot of these types of places, like, oh my goodness, look at this fabulous, just look Gorgeous. at this fabulous screen right here. A lot of these things are used in movies and on movie sets yep. here as the movies are being made. Leah Stewart looked at this and he said, oh, look here. He's relaxing and she's working. <laughs> <laughs> ain't, it the, ain't it always the way? Ain't it always the way? What an interesting like design on there. So yeah. crazy. Okay, Leah, lead us around to where the main kind of right. gallery oh, area yeah. is. I can get both of them in the shop though. Talent right there. This looks like... I think you pay mostly for the sound with that. God, this, is, this is incredible. I'm gonna take that sound for a fold. That's when good. when I nice. decorate my hacienda, I'll, oh, that is cool. I didn't get in front of it. Yeah, I'll that use that piece. Wow, look at those. Do you see the heads on top or whatever these are? Yeah, Leah, have you found some rugs? Well, honestly, like these are on sale. I, I know. I know. I'm. I've, I am eyeing this one. Okay, here's my question of oh, the day. Yes, but that's why. Well, because the colors, right? Uh, yeah, because I have something similar to this. Uh, I love that. Are we that, recording too? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Are we recording? This is a real conversation. Yeah, and that's, I think, why I was drawn to it. <laughs> yes, just a little bit, but that's okay. It's good, the question design. That is cute. I have thick skin. <laughs> okay, let's wander back around. This oh. Way. Linda, what was this for? What? This chest, like it has the like pointed forward drawers. Or what's the, I don't, I don't know. If you guys I'm know what this was, all. it, you know, it might have been a kitchen thing where they kept kitchen storage ideas in here. I don't know, but I'm kind of afraid to touch it. 
for, for fear I'll break it. Um, in this area, this is where, Leah, in here is where we need to come back later. As she walks in there. I didn't hear you. As I walk in here. Well, I mean, just to yeah. show you, because th these, this would be a great idea. Great door knockers. Like that would have been wonderful. Oh, yeah. At my old house. I don't know if I. I like the horse one. Obviously. Yeah, the horse one. And you want it to kind of match whatever the aesthetic is of your house. But this would be a great one of a kind gift to bring somebody. You can't look. On a, I, I, I'm looking with my eyes off the camera. <laughs> so I can't stop looking away from the camera. And things. they're all different. <laughs> they're all different price points. Um, just let's just do kind of a sweep of this. I mean, hinges. <laughs> it, it, yeah, door knockers, <laughs> hooks. Uh, oh, look at these doorknobs. Oh, those are cute. <gasps> those are incredible. Look at these blue and white doorknobs. Look uh -oh. here. Oh, oh my oh. gosh. Can you see those blue and white ones? ones? I think so. You may have to come right over there. this oh, side. Right here? No, you had it. You had it. Oh, right there. Let me slide this one over. Right there. Linda's dreams. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah. Yeah. Just, yeah, there might be something for your daddy in here. Oh, there definitely is. It's just a matter of which one. One for you, one for him. One for you, one for him. And Linda, look up. There's mailboxes. Oh, yeah. Oh, look up. Look up. Oh, look up. Take our yes. own advice. Look okay, up. let's go this way so we can do the grand okay. entrance. Okay. Okay, and here we go. This, this, I guess, is the main <laughs> gallery area. And where you look up. At, look yes, up. and definitely where you look up. Hello in there. Hi. Oh my gosh, look at this. Old no, horse. Oh, we got two people telling me to go different ways. Look at this. Old carousel. Coming that way, guy. Yeah, he's Keep collecting coming. a bunch of those. I like. All right, I don't know which Come way to go. All right, we're gonna... Look at yeah, follow Leah. All That's right. okay. <laughs> it's hard being, for us to maintain I'm being focus here. Directions. Look at all the wall art over yeah. there. Stuart, this is where you may find. Look right there. Those square. Oh, and the ones I like. Oh, we're gonna talk about what I like, and they're way too much for me. But these silver, like downtown oh, New York art. looking ones. Oh, the Art Deco oh, art ones. Deco. Those look like they belong in so First cool. National downtown. Yeah, yeah they, they, might they might have been in First National oh downtown. God. I'm surprised they would have not used them, however. And they, I well, like, look at this guy, chair. too. This giant that one right here. That matches my house. That's yeah. Just massive. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. Look at that. That's on, now that's on somebody's ranch. I got to show you my Pinterest board of the tear sheet, my tear sheet. Your Pinterest, yeah, your Pinterest <laughs> sheets. Okay, fun. Look at these fun wall hangings these over stamps. here. <laughs> Great old mirrors. This is a, ooh. Look here. Great Dance. mirrors. Uh -huh. Which one is your favorite? Wow. Um, I, don't, I don't know which one is my favorite, but boy, these are fun. I like the rectangle one with the box. So, so pretty. Good. Oh, look at, yeah, look at this one. Ah. <gasps> I love that. Oh, this one's kind of cool. Too. And it's, it's got cool. this kind of um, mercury, I don't know, weathered glass, not mercury glass, but weathered glass. So this is very similar to the fireplace surrounds that I bought for my other house. In fact, this one is very close to it. And then there were some with some great big finials. And then do you like nail it to your fireplace? How does that work? Uh, I don't know how it went up because oh, the, the contractor did it. Um, Be a cool clock for a couple. Yeah. <laughs> cool, cool stuff for lots of cool applications. Have we said anything about your haircut? Oh yeah, Leah cut my hair. Did okay, you guys hey, notice that Leah cut my hair? This, the light in here isn't very flattering. It's good. But Leah cut my hair. I did. Yeah. We just took her kitchen scissors and, and chopped. just chopped it. And they really we do have B-roll of that. And we do <laughs> have some B-roll of that, yes. <laughs> this is wonderful. And these are the kind of pieces I would not touch. I would just install it just like that. God, I, I just can't like move without going up and down. 
Are we moving too there's fast? No, little, not there's little yeah. treasures yeah, everywhere. Good. Yeah, there's little treasures everywhere from trying to show doors. Really old newspapers. Cool old doors. Looks like school doors. Look at this. So cute. Ninety-nine cents. Just the way yeah. that everything was drawn and yeah. illustrated. Cents. There's not a single dollar sign in this thing. Yeah, I'm sure they do. Shout out to Kansas City. Okay, how cool we is this? It. That is awesome. Yeah, those are, those are particularly... And this is just oh. relatively, this is just $42. And how cool is that? You can see why lots of restaurants come here to get things. Mm -hmm. And if you had some kind of emotional connection to the Navy, that would be wonderful. Um, well, Linda wanted us to give a little shout out to this gorgeous tin work. If you're looking for anything like that, they also Such just this way they have scrap pieces of wood and Tons tables and legs for tables. Even and stuff up there. There's a baby crib up there. There's a, baby, a rocking baby crib. Um, truly, so many pieces. Indeed. My dad restores houses and just for fun, kind of. But I brought him here, and he was in heaven. So. He yeah. Pretty cool. Hey, Stuart, come in, Come here when you're finished. <laughs> There's Linda Yellen. Yeah. 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 <laughs> what if you just saw me in Mesto Park with a baby in this? <laughs> It'd be like some creepy movie. It'd, It'd be like a scary movie. <laughs> The staircase to know where Linda. Oh, there she is. We see her through the place. There she is. Oh, this one's cute though. Oh my gosh, you guys! I found something I love so much. Uh oh. How we get yeah. There. Can you figure out how to get here? Uh, we can do it. I think we can figure it out. Oh wow! Young Stewart would have died for all that up there. For what? I love the Asian blind oh. writers things. It's I so found cool. a chest of drawers here that is incredible. In all of its worn. Oh, wow. I, I think look how this, high off the ground it is, too. Well, it's look neat. at those feet. Yeah, it's really neat. Look at those feet. I mean, this is a really great storage piece. And I love the fact that it is this weathered. Yeah, the I look love is cool. the colors of it. I love the price of it. It's on sale for three fifteen. Wow. I know. Wow. Or like that. <laughs> really you good. better take and it the, home today or some the, followers are going to come get it. I know. The drawers aren't even stuck, but look at those Oh, feet. the downside to, put, to putting out what's good on the I know. <laughs> maybe it, Really. Let's move on. Let's move on. Let's this, cut this. This is just incredible. I mean, this is... Now, the problem is... You almost need to do, put a locator tag on anything you find yeah. because Practice, it's hard easy. to find it. Find it again. Things look the so same in multiple directions. Yeah. yeah. So through the archway. Through the archway, we through just need to be so pretty, like styled in the garden. Oh, oh, I see this with plaid blankets coming out of it. Yeah. With just, it is just incredible. Uh, yes, it would be beautiful in the garden, but I wouldn't. I would hate to yeah. put it there. Um, and I don't know that there's anywhere I have a place to put it, but this is, this looks so Ralph <laughs> Lauren-y to me. It looks so Jill Sharp to me. Mm -hmm. And that is really a great price. And that's without, so without, with a 10% discount, that would be under $300. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Let's remember this. Okay. Okay. This is another great table. This one is... Oh, yeah. It's on wheels. It's got wonderful shells. I can see terracotta pots in here. Mm -hmm. If you've got a potting shed, um, it's, I mean, it's pretty wonderful. I, I just can see if you're somebody like, if you collect forged finds for t photography or something and you need a place to store them, I can see that. I love the fact that the table is just kind of roughed up. This would make a great nightstand mm. it is functional on so many levels it's in good shape and it is only 78 dollars okay i have i'm revisiting this chest of drawers leah look at how gorgeous 
that looks. I'm telling you, it's magical. From, I mean, look at it, what it looks like from this side. It just has a magic air about it. Yeah. And you don't even pay extra for the fact that it's aged. And you don't okay. even have to work for it. You don't even have to work <laughs> yeah. for it. Yeah. No patina. This is fun. This is the kind of case that my husband keeps his fly yeah. fishing stuff in. He has one of those great cases. Yeah. Okay, here's another question for you guys. What would you do with these wonderful, perfectly aged blue legs? I guess you could turn them into candle holders. There, I'm sure there's a million. You guys are more you think creative like than two, I. Uh, but two weeks to be used as legs too. Yeah, I don't. Who knows? Who knows? But they're really, really wonderful. And I saw these over here. And if you were styling. Um, Kind of an out of Africa kind of look. Come on the other side of the way. Look at these. Oh wow. Aren't these great? They don't make them like they used to. They do don't they? make them like they used to. <laughs> it's heavy. It's cool. Looking. And this this is just is that corduroy? What's this is from? just twenty five dollars. Is that corduroy now? But look here. Yeah, that's neat. Wow. Now that is some luggage. Smells old, not bad. It's old. It smells old. It's cool. Leah, look at these. I saw those. So I mean, pretty. If you were doing an out of Africa kind of thing, and there's two of them. Oh. Really cool. Yeah, I keep looking away from the camera while we're shooting and looking at other things. Yeah, so there's sorry, so much the to look at. <laughs> okay, that's all Stuart's fault. I just can't stop looking at it. It's all stuff. Stuart's fault. Oh man. I was I'm so curious. Like, what is this? Yeah. What is this thing? Just like you put a. That's. Is that like a mannequin head thing? I, I don't know. No, it it probably was. Oh, it's a garden house it. thing. It's a fountain, maybe. <laughs> let's go outside and let's, let's head towards the gardening stuff outside. All right. Well, lest you think that Americana stuff from the 50s and 60s isn't represented. Oh, wow. Look there, there's all sorts of old diner things, old cabinetry. Let's just go back there, yeah, let's yeah great sinks. <laughs> oh, wow. Wonderful so sinks. This is, this is the stuff I like. I feel drawn to this era. There's, I can't remember where I saw it, but there's like old bathtubs. Oh, look at this delight ballerina stand. Did you see this? It's like a ballerina. I guess you put stuff on the, I don't know what you do. With I don't that. know, I don't know what that is. <laughs> Okay, but there's, look at this. Oh, this is great. It's good we came over here. Look at the hearse. This Holy is. Smokes. Oh, it's like their company vehicle. Dead people stuff. That's pretty cool. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Dead on arrival. Dead pretty on long. arrival. Pretty neat. Lots of old sinks. And just in case you are in the market for a pink bathtub, they have you covered. Not to I, mention old toilets. I have pulled one of these cast iron toilets out of a bag. And they are heavy. It is not fun. Hey, Linda, look up. Oh my. Oh Neither my one God. of us saw that for what, what It's gigantic, this? whatever it is. What is this? It's the biggest think? upside down garden or hanging basket ever. Now, you talk about <laughs> a large. <laughs> You talk about a large cloche, a large garden cloche, that would be it. I don't know how I didn't see that walking over here. It's so good. Whoa. Oh, look at the size of this glass sliding door. I and mean, this is all just so fascinating to me. But that's like, what, what room had that sliding door? I don't, yeah, who knows? Okay, I'm getting Nancy. Let's go outside. And here we go. Okay. The garden stuff. Garden stuff. More fountains, pedestals, urns, old brick, wine barrels, finials, estate planters, pieces of concrete. Ooh, here's another good bird bath. A lot of bird baths. A lot of bird baths. Okay, now this is. This isn't an antique, I don't think, because I've got one of these at home, and these are fiberglass. But if I wanted two more of what I already have, good to know. 
garden ornaments. Oh, fencing. Stonework. Ooh, look at this wicker piece. I love old this wicker. Be, like I was saying earlier, one of those great spots for like they're doing a restaurant, club, all that I stuff. And it looks like over there is where they're Yeah, it's a, it's Ooh, a wicker. cool spot. Oh, wow. Yeah, big cool too. wicker. It's gigantic. Some great old metal tables. Great chairs. That's great. a cool kind of old wooden ladder over Look there. Look at those blue chairs. Those <laughs> I know, aren't so they so cute? cute. Oh, shop. Cute. Oh, I, call, I, love I always those. think of ice cream shops when I see those. You're rubbing off on me with the blue. Am I? Apparently. Apparently. Look at these blue and white tiles. I know. Speaking okay, of. Linda. Where? Oh my goodness. Those would be so pretty. Oh, and look at the green and white too. Yeah, a lot of them. Even the copper. Like, yes. Oh my goodness. Well, there you go, guys. I, I, I'm sorry you have just had to put up with 30 minutes of our Excla exclamations as we as we move from one area to another all i can say is you need to come here and see this for yourself comment it, if there's anything we missed yes yeah. comment if see. yeah how did we how did you miss that um what else do we need to tell them leah come on down to oklahoma city come on down to oklahoma city and dead people stuff. Uh, to de yeah dead people stuff before it's too late and we're all dead too <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha!